final goal is in sight. The very finest warriors have returned to pit themselves against each other and the quest to prove who among them is fit to bear the title ultimate champion. But they must proceed with care, as Navar still stalks this land. His vile henchmen dog our every step as they try to thwart the warrior's progress. But we will not be distracted from our purpose. I must strive to return this land to its true path and bring light to the darkness. The quest is reaching its climax. Challenge, begin. This is Treasure Ring, a head-to-head -head challenge that tests warriors to their limits. It is a race to grasp the gold ring in the midst of a loch first, using the rope to haul their craft through these icy waters. The loser of this race will surrender a valuable life. Despite a hasty dip, Dyrell claims the gold and increases her lead. I was really determined to get this ring, um, as at the end I sort of dived for it, because um, I really, really didn't want to lose a life. There is a glimmer of light appearing for our four remaining warriors. A light that shines from the notion that soon, one of them will earn the title Ultimate Champion. They must be sure of this, though, for the further they travel on the quest, the rougher the road will become. But this day has just begun. A hard fought and well matched race saw Dyrell's strength and stamina win through in the end. Javmi, Tridic, are you ready? Ready! Then let the challenge begin. Javmi is in last place in the company and can ill afford another life lost here. I was quite surprised that I won this challenge because Javmi is a really strong warrior and I knew that she would put up a good fight. Dyrell continues to lead the warriors with seven lives and three gold rings. Tridic's speed on the loch saw her glide into second place, overtaking Bertar. He and Javmi were bettered by their comrades and therefore must lose a life. They must battle harder if they are to survive this penultimate day of the quest. I now have seven lives and three rings, um, and I'm really happy about that because it gives me almost a safety net, but I really don't want to have to use that. I want to just keep uh, going up the way instead of having to start going down. Uh, trying to make a bowl or something like that. So it goes, young warriors. The day is young, yet already, Javmi and Berta, you have had to relinquish a precious life. But do not let the setback steer you off course. The honor of ultimate champion is still within your grasp. You must all defend the rings and feathers you have on your standards with all your might. For by day's end, the warrior who holds the fewest must face the most potent of trials. Fail this, and your hopes of becoming ultimate champion will be dashed. Javmi, despite bearing the wave upon your standard, you failed to triumph on the water at Treasure Ring. This now keeps you rooted in last place. Is your challenge over, or can you yet survive this day? 
Yes, I am quite concerned. I've lost quite a few lives, but I'm not going to be disheartened. Um, I'm determined to carry on and not let anything stop me, and I'm just going to try my best. I wish you well. Berta, you're also in a precarious position. Just five rings separate you and Javmi. Can you shine like the moon on your chest and pull yourself out of danger? I have been trying quite hard, but not as hard as I think I could be. So I think I really, really need to up my game if I want to catch up with Dyrell again. My friends, let us not linger. I sense evil is stalking us. Follow me. A champion warrior relies not just on strength and courage, for they know their mind can be as powerful as muscle in times of peril. You must flex this mental muscle now if you are to cross the riddle path. A malevolent mist hangs heavy in these woods, waiting to engulf the unwary. But the riddle path will protect you if you can solve its puzzle. Javmi, you are our last place warrior, so you will walk the path. Bertar, you are second to last, so you will assist. Step forward. Within this magical book is a riddle which the pages will relate to you. The answer you seek lies hidden within these stones. But be wary, tread on the wrong stones, and the mists will take you both. When the sands in this glass run out, your challenge is over. Are you ready? Ready! Then, let the challenge begin. I can tear through a crust. I give mantle no peace. Until I'm extinct, smoke I shall release. OK, so say it's extinct, it should release smoke or something, so... Mm. What releases smoke? Have you got any ideas or anything? Um. Do you want to listen to it once more? Yeah. OK. I can tear through a crust. I give mantle no peace. Until I'm extinct, smoke I shall release. OK, try A. I just try A, see what happens. Because I don't have any ideas. Well... It appears this riddle has proved beyond Javmi and Bertar. Let us see if you have your wits about you. Dyrell, you will walk the path, and Drudic, you will assist. Step forward. Are you ready? Ready! Then, let the challenge begin. I can tear through a crust. I give mantle no peace. Until I'm extinct, smoke I shall release. What do you think it could be? I don't know. Um, mantles, volcanoes and crusts yeah. as well, yeah. yeah. Should we try it? Right, B. O. L. C. A. N. O. Dyrell's generosity is to be commended. Allowing Tridic to take all three rings from the riddle path shows comradeship indeed. But tomorrow, only one warrior can be named ultimate champion. Might she regret this decision? Bertar and Javmi must be rescued from the mists, and both must lose another life. Each has only three feathers remaining, but Bertar has the advantage of five rings. I was all the way up in second place with five lies and five rings and I'm now down to three lies and five rings and I think if I want to still take part in this quest I think I really, really need to up my game or I could just um, say goodbye right now.
This northern landscape is filled with the most callous of terrain. To survive here, a warrior must be as confident in the water as he is on dry land. Your challenge is to enter this biting, hostile water and swim to yonder platform. Upon reaching it, you must haul yourself aboard and claim a single gold ring. Then you must plunge yourself back into these icy waters and make haste to shore. And the first warrior to reach dry land will claim a further three gold rings. The second will take two, and the third will claim one. But alas, whoever is last to reach dry land will surrender a precious life. Warriors, are you ready? Ready! Then let the challenge begin. Trillic has taken an early lead over her fellows. But has she the stamina to maintain it? These waters can sap a warrior's energy. Almost there, Bertha. Retrieve your two gold rings. Almost there, Dyrell. Fine effort, my young friend. That I'll claim the final gold ring. Javmi is exhausted by her efforts and is beaten by Deep Loch. I think I fell behind in this challenge as the other warriors were stronger swimmers than myself. Uh, they were more determined and just really wanted to win it more than I did. Trick's success this day continues. An impressive performance on the loch earned her four gold rings, and she gains back a life. Bertar's precarious position propelled him through the freezing waters. Three much-needed rings are added to his standard. Dyrell took two pieces of gold and remains ahead of the pack by a life and two rings. Brave Javmi fought on, even when her strength deserted her, but she failed to conquer Deep Loch and must lose another life. Her once bright hopes of becoming ultimate champion now seem dimmed. I'm feeling slightly more confident about future challenges because I'm still in second place and all I've got to do is keep that up and I will be in the last stand battling it out to become ultimate champion. Evil has consumed this forest, for Navar has dispatched his foot soldiers to encumber your quest with this despicable trap. Before you, a web of threads affixed with bells. In their midst are four gold rings. Your challenge is to retrieve these gold rings without sounding the bells that will waken the demons from their trance-like slumber. Each of you must be in possession of gold if you are to pass safely by the demon who stands guard at the exit to this wicked web. If any of you are taken by the demons, your fellow warriors may pick up your ring if they so desire. Dyrell, as you are our forerunner, you must lead us into this challenge. Warriors, are you ready? Ready! Then let the challenge begin. Get quite low, that's it. That's it. Okay. So take your time. Okay. 
Ooh, well done. Well done. That was tough. <laughs> Well done. Well done. Right, okay, now I just need to make sure I don't... I'll try and get to the end now. Right. Take it slowly. Yeah. That's it. Okay. Right. Tyrell made a fatal mistake. Her lead is now in question. Right, take it easy. Take your time. I would go through the middle. From this view, it looks the yeah. easiest option. Which ring are you going to go for? Um, do you think you might be able to go for the one Tyrell dropped? Or? Yeah, because I'll try that one. Yeah. It's closest. Take it slowly, think about what you're doing. I'm going to take it really slowly. Careful now. Well done, Tridic. Keep going. Okay. Come on, Tridic. Go on, Tridic. That's it. Got it? Well done. Now take it easy because you've got a ring and that's all. Yeah, take your time. Yeah. You've got the ring. Nearly there. Well done. Well done. Tridic's stealth and caution ensured her success. Take it nice and slowly. That's it. Well done. Well done, better. Yep, yeah. Yeah, come round. Yep, just go over that one. That's it, well done. A confident performance. Go on, Do you think like, that ring's easier for her? Just got to take the route. Except, yeah, to, because this one she could. Yeah. Um, Jab, mate. Jab, mate, if you're going for one, then that one looks on, easier to get. Oh, that one no, there. because that one would okay. bite on Let me just get on with She pulled it down. Good point. Wait a minute. No, just let her, just let her do it. Right, just give it. Are you doing really well? Difficult to see from here. It is actually really difficult. It's option two. This one or that one? Um, I think your best option would to go for this one because if you hold the skull, pull the ring off in it because it seems to be. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Just take it steady. Well done, Javni. Got one. Now, can you sort of work your way around yep. um, that rock and come over this way? Yeah. Well, 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 Right, do you want to go for it or just? Yeah, might as well. Well done. Well done. Right, now come. Oh. Now, um, now um, you just need to come through there. Come through here. Take your foot over, and then yeah, just come through there. Then, yes. Well yeah, done. Yeah, well done, well done Javmi. Congratulations, Javmi. Once I'd got to the ring, um, I was quite happy, but I was a bit worried whether I might pull it and it would um, hit a bell. But once I got the ring and made it to the other end, I was really, really happy.
Navar's fiends claimed only one victim in Thrall Forest. Tyrell must be restored to this quest and forfeits a precious life, diminishing her one strong lead. Tririk is now but a single ring behind her, having gathered a remarkable nine pieces of gold since sunrise. Bertar remains in third place, but the ring gained here has earned him back a precious life. Javmi bettered all of her comrades, taking two gold rings from the demons. Alas, it was her first victory of the day, and I fear it has come too late. And so our quest brings us to this place once more, a challenge that has crushed the aspirations of many potential champions. This is the way of the warrior. Beyond this portal lies a challenge so perilous that few who have stood in its shadow have emerged triumphant. Berta, you have only four lives left, an unenviable position. But alas, Javmi, with just two lives and two rings, it is you who must enter the fray alone. Your journey has been long and distinguished, and you should be proud of your achievements here. Can you add your name to the roll of honor of those who have conquered the way of the warrior? Hopefully, yes, I can be triumphant in this challenge with strength and courage, and hopefully if I just think about each obstacle before I do it, take my time and go for it, I hope for my name to be up on that board as well. I wish you well, my young friend. Javmi. You must thrive here if you wish to continue your quest to become ultimate champion. Do you have what it takes? Hopefully I do have what it takes um, to be triumphant in this challenge. I've just got to concentrate, take it easy and think about what I'm doing. Remember, pass through the portal at the end of the path and you may continue on this quest. Fail and you must leave us and return home. Are you ready? Ready! Then may the luck of the Raven's Eye be with you. Let the challenge begin. Javmi must not touch these vile machines.
Javmi, a valiant effort, but this challenge is indeed a beast that shows no mercy. You have come far in this quest to become ultimate champion. Your exit here is indeed a bitter blow, but one that you can counter with the thought that you have achieved much distinction on your journey. Farewell. Leaving the quest now, um, I do feel disappointed. However, I am proud of all the things I've accomplished and all the things I've achieved. I've upheld the traditions of a true warrior, honour, dignity, strength, wisdom and courage um, and I've learnt many things. I've thoroughly enjoyed my experience on the quest um, and I'm going to leave with my head held high. The road to becoming ultimate champion is relentless and unforgiving. Many warriors have been lost thus far. With tomorrow's dawn heralding the final day of the quest, only one can emerge victorious. Bertar, with Javme's demise, you are now the last placed warrior, with two lives separating you from your fellows. How can you regain the ground you have lost before tomorrow's time of reckoning? Um, I think I need to put a lot more effort into it if I want to have a good shot at the last stand. Darrell, your lead has now slipped to a single gold ring. Is this enough to achieve the title of ultimate champion? I just need to stay focused and hopefully I'll be able to um, go at least to the last stand. Trick, tell me your thoughts. Well, now I'm only one ring behind Dyrell, so hopefully I will be able to gain more gold rings and go ahead of her in the future challenges. To do this, I will need to put maximum effort into every single challenge that comes my way. Remember, courage cannot see round corners, but chooses to go round them regardless. My friends, let us find refuge. Tomorrow, the final battle to become ultimate champion awaits. You will need all your strength, courage, wit, and fortitude. This way. Next time on Raven, the warriors race for victory in the precarious pontoon pursuit. Who has the metal to snatch gold in ring reach? Another Braveheart must enter the dreaded way of the warrior before the remaining comrades face Navar's wrath. But who will be named Ultimate Champion?